Hey guys, what's up? Today is Tuesday and Tuesday? Yeah, Tuesday. I'm losing all track of my days, which is just horrible. But anyway, I'm coming back here today with an all new video. And do you want to meet Slants? His name is Slants. And I won him at, in those, like, grab ball things where you're like, dropped him. Hang on. Oh, slant. <laughs> so, alright. So, this is what brings me to the moral of my um, video today. I wanted to talk about... Me and Slants wanted to talk about, um, give a thumbs up for Slants. And give a thumbs up if you like, um, those claw games. So, which brings me to my video, is about addictions. Things that we obsess about, we love, and things that we cannot pretty much go without, even though sometimes we probably should go without them. So, um, example A for me would be, I am addicted to um, those claw games, which is how I got slants right here. I don't know. And every time I see one, whether I'm in the grocery store, because you know they have to, they put those freaking things right there where kids can see them. <laughs> I said kids, even though I'm not. But still, I mean, they're still fun. And you know what? I will waste. I will. I will admit. I will waste dollars and dollars and dollars to get something like this. <laughs> There's so many things that I've gotten from grab machines or claw games, whatever you want to call them. Everybody calls them something different. Um, either way, uh, every time I see a claw machine, if they have them at uh, our, they have them at our grocery stores, they have them at our movie theaters. They have them at um, like Walmart and Target and all that stuff. So every time I see one, I have to play. And it's usually 50 cents a try. And for the most part, I'm not going to lie and I'm not going to brag, but usually the first try, I usually get something. And that is not a myth. That is a fact. And if I don't get it the first time, I definitely get it the second time. So I normally only have to use a dollar maybe two, depending on how much it is, because they're all different prices. I can't help it. It's an addiction. I like playing. Like I said, that's how I got slants. Ugh, don't make fun of him. Don't judge. Don't judge me. I'm an alien. And the next addiction, which I just got done doing, doing, drinking, is coffee. Uh, okay, a lot, I have a lot of different myths and facts on this. People say, oh, it's a drug. Okay, yes, technically coffee beans are a drug. But in, in the end, it's not something that's going to kill us. And I can't help it. I, I, just gotta, I just have to have it. I have to have it. In the morning, I wake up and I have to get, I have to get my crack, my fix for the day. I can't do anything. I can't talk to anyone without having my crack my morning crack and people might think it's weird but most people let's admit we all drink coffee for the most part or tea and actually tea has caffeine in it as well but I have to have my coffee in the morning before I do anything I mean I can't make a video I can't talk to someone I mean I can but I'll probably be like yeah mm hmm we go get coffee. Mm hmm. Okay. Can we go get coffee now. Can we make some coffee? And then after I, after I drink coffee, I'm like, ah, what do you want to do? What do you want to do? Actually, that's a complete myth. I don't jump around like that. But um, I don't get that effect when I drink caffeine. Um, but I, I am addicted to double shot uh, espresso drinks um, from Starbucks. So, right there was two things that I am obsessed about. 
Um, the third one is Gushers. Now, I know it's a little weird. You might not even know what they are, but they're fruit snacks. With hat. They have like uh, um, uh, liquid. I was going to say something else, and it would have been a she said moment. It probably would have been a great moment. Anyway, side note. Um, so, I love Gushers, and they're just so good. And I just will suck. <laughs> That's what she said. I'll just suck on them until like they're nothing anymore. Until their juicy liquidness stuff shoots out and I still suck away. Yep, that's a total, that's what she said moments. <laughs> oh, anyway, whatever. I like those, I'm obsessed with them. I have to eat them every night before I actually eat my dinner. And if I don't, it throws my schedule, it throws my eating routine all off. I know, I know, it's a little weird, but I don't know. My next obsession would be, um, I like Tom's shoes. And if you don't know what they are, you should know. And you should go to their site right, right now, www.toms.org or .com. I think it's .com. And the good thing about it, which I really like, is every time you purchase a pair of shoes, a pair of Tom's shoes, um, Tom's will give a pair of shoes to a child in need that does not have shoes. So it's it's they their slogan is one for one because you buy a pair of shoes for yourself, and the good thing is is that a pair of shoes is going to a child in need that has no shoes. So I think that's really cool of them to do that and really awesome. So you can't really go wrong there, especially if you like to donate and do things that are better for the world and I'm all about that. So I love Tom's shoes. Um, they're really comfy. I have an awesome brown, like chocolate brown color and they're just so cute. If you follow me on Instagram, there's pictures of them on there, but they're just so cute. I just love Tom's. Um, and I have a sticker that I haven't put on my car yet, but I'm gonna. I just keep forgetting to do it. Um, addiction, again, another one is tattoos. I mean, you guys know this. Tattoos. Sleeve tattoos. Ooh, let's see your muscle. Bam, I don't really have one, do I? I don't know, my arms are just tiny. Whatever. Tattoos, 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 tattoos. Just breathe. Tattoos. 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 And so, tattoos. I just love them. And they're addicting. And you know what? It all started when I was 17. A long, 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 very long time ago. When I got a sunflower tattoo on my back. Back here. And about this big and it started when I was 17 like I said a very very long time ago and um, I haven't stopped since and I'm <coughs> 31 it's, no you're 25 what are you you be quiet over there 31 what are you talking about you're crazy so that's an addiction I, I can't stop I just keep going I keep going Keep going. Oh my god. I just keep going. Slants, what am I gonna do? Oh, the addictions. And, alright. Hang on, I gotta get slants back. Okay, so that's addiction. That's a huge one. I know that's a big one for people. Um,. I would say shopping is an addiction, but I really, see this is the thing, I'm going to explain something really quick. I like to get new things, I like to get new hats, new beanies, new t-shirts, um, new boxers, but I don't like actually shopping. Uh, I like the clothes, but I don't actually like shopping. But when I see something, I'm like, oh my god, I have to have it, it's so cute. Like. I just have to have it. It's just awesome or cute or it's just totally me and I'm like, oh my god, I have to have it. And then I'm like, oh, you have no money. So you're not getting that. <laughs> but so I guess that's not really an addiction. I just like new things. I love the smell of um, 
like weird things but I like the smell of freshly cut grass even though it really affects my allergies and just makes me sneeze and cry pretty much for the most part huh and um along with a bunch of other things but we won't go there right now and then another uh, addiction is um, necklaces I'm like addicted to and obsessed with necklaces like this one from Hollister um, I will go to great lengths to buy these. So if you see any of these, like this, send them my way and I will send you a thank you letter signed by me. Um, but yeah, I do, I'm obsessed with necklaces like these, like the choker ones. I have so many, but I always wear this one for some reason. But yeah, I'm really, really obsessed. I, I, I'm obsessed with necklaces. Just, I'm just obsessed. Slants. What are we gonna do? What 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 am I gonna do about that? He has no clue. Um, and then the last thing I would say I'm obsessed, addicted to is my eating disorder. And that's not a positive thing, but I'm addicted to do it. It's part of me, it's part of my life. Um, fortunately, you know, I am trying and I and I do good on some days and bad on some some days and it's different and whatever but um, it's something that I lean on a lot especially when I'm having a really really hard time I don't eat trigger trigger point I should have said so um, yeah I mean I just it's a bad thing but I'm really really addicted to my eating disorder um, I'm trying to think I love the smell of candles. I'm addicted to candles. I will put my whole house and have a seance of candles in my whole in my whole house or in my room. Like I will have candles lit from the day to the night. I just I love candles. I'm obsessed. I guess I guess I'm obsessed. Oh, slants. <laughs> What's wrong with me? So that are the things. Oh, that. You know what? I'm going to wind up killing him, and I'm not going to be very happy about that at all. So, that concludes. Do you like these? They're pink there, and then they're red right there. How cool is that? <laughs> so, that concludes my obsession, obsessed, obsessed things. We're going to go. <laughs> Slants and I are going to go. But, um, yeah, before I go. Oh, wait. Uh, yeah. So, peace, love. Um, I love you guys. Be kind to one another. Be kind to yourselves. Be cool. Be kind. Don't judge. And I'll talk to you very, very soon. Maybe today, maybe tomorrow. You never know when you're going to see me. Now do ya. I love you guys. Bye. Goodbye.